what's up guys welcome back to another video today we're going to be carrying on with our uh nothing spiral set video so hopefully we can at least get another wheel in the set but we'll have to wait and see um so last episode i think we left off with the burnt sienna ones or like the episode before that so that's all we have so far so hopefully we can get like i don't know maybe crimson that'd be pretty cool i get probably the most expensive ones out of the way first maybe I don't know, we'll just see what's what and then hopefully someone has like ones we need but we'll just try and make as much progress as we can and I'll just see you in the trades yeah so for this first trade I'm picking up a fire plug for a nitro crate which it can be good but if it's like a bad day then like, you might be able to like, not sell fire plugs but I think later on in the video I did manage to sell them for profit so that is a good trade right there yeah so here we go moving on to this one we literally just sold our fire plugs for a sweeper uh, blazer is that blazer of friction I'm not too sure but and also a zeno splash so that's probably about I'd say about four crates at least right there but we'll have to wait and see so here this is a pretty decent trade so i've swapped out just normal regular turbines for a crimson falco but like this is the exotic format so i'm pretty sure i managed to sell that on for quite a bit i'm not too sure the guy had any clue like what it was but yeah for this one this is a really good trade um we managed to pick up a black crown which is worth 10 crates alone and a pixel fire for just an overdrive crate which is really good so that's about that's at least probably 12 crates right there um maybe 11 but yeah so here we go i'm kind of regretting doing this now i wish i did sell them for just sell the royal crown for crates rather than uh just these here but it's still a good trade seeing as i i'm essentially getting all this for like a crate so I'm pretty sure it's Tachyon, Hypernova and a Zeno Splash, which is decent I guess, but I could have done better if I waited out longer. But we'll have to like just go with whatever we can get I guess. Here's a, another decent trade I guess, we're um, selling the Blazer and a CC2 crate for a Animus GP, which isn't too bad I guess. The Animus GP is just kind of hard to move but we'll have to wait and see what we can do with that yeah sorry about this trade it's like really glitchy i don't know why it's happened to a few of these trades here but what's happened is i'm thinking i think i've put up 13 crates and i'm getting a sky blue pink and crimson unicorn back uh so if i can sell them all for like near enough the full value that would be making profit but not too much crates profit maybe about three or four probably so moving on we've just sold our animus gp for three painted berets they're going for about probably two to four a piece i'd say so it's a pretty decent trade but we'll have to just see what we can do with them they'll probably stay in the inventory for quite a bit maybe sell them for like two greats each if I can that is but I'll have to just wait and see so for this trade we've just sold our hypernova for two overdrive greats um so I'm probably just going to try and sell everything for crates and then buy spiralis wheels with just straight up crates rather than like items itself unless they do want them but here we're selling the or well, buying so I say a lime unicorn horn for two crates i would have thought this is a quite a hard like a hard to sell item as it's like lime and not really many people want it but as you can see here we're just selling it on straight away for four nitros pretty decent crates as well one of the best i'd say so it's all in all a good trade um So here we go, we're picking up our second uh, Spiralis wheel in this set. We get it for 11 crates, it's a pink Spiralis, which I guess it's one crate overpay if you think about it like that. Seeing as it goes for 0.2, 0.2 is 
20xx but it's just part of the series in it so I'll just do what I can to get them yeah again here this is a good trade um but it's a shame because it's like glitching out again so basically I think the saffron devil horns I'm selling for a lime plasma and just certified SLKs not quite sure what certification they are but they're just yeah that's a decent trade here we're selling our uh, second unicorn this episode for five greats four of them being overdrive one night sure I think it was but yeah four overdrives one night sure and now we're selling our third uni for eight crates it's two great underpaid but I don't really mind because you rarely ever do get ten crates for the black or red black or crimson sorry uh toppers in tier one but it's still a decent trade it's eight crates i got three of them for 13 so eight is a decent amount to sell it on for just one of them so that's it. pretty decent i guess but Yeah, here we go. We finally sold our Falco wheels. This took quite a while to do, but it was, I think it was worth it. Seeing as we only picked them up for a turbine wheel, I think it was. Uh, we sold it on for a Mantis, a, a painted breakout, an overdrive crate, and what else was it? Breakout Type S. So, yeah, that was a decent trade as well. Here we're moving on, or selling on, should I say, our Lion Plasma for a grey merc and four crates again sorry for the like the glitchiness of this trade i wish i did like check it all through before recording but oh well and we're picking up it's pretty much just the easiest part of the series i'd say just the normal spiralis wheel for players choice crate yeah so i'm gonna finish off this episode here um we did actually make quite a good profit actually like really good profit so we've managed to get some berets uh we've got two painted imports like the uh the older vehicles like just in like, new painted formats uh got a few of them for good prices i guess or like this here was like an ad for a few crates we managed to get um two of the new spiralises we needed that's pretty cool so we've got the normal one burnt sienna one and pink ones and all so that's pretty good so at the moment i'd reckon i reckon we could easily get another uh spiralis we all like next episode i'm probably going to go for a 0.3 price one so either a titanium white or a crimson one if i can get my hands on one that is but if not i'll just i don't know We'll just see what's what and then hopefully we can get a spiralis for like maybe even like five crates or something. That'd be pretty awesome. But hopefully yeah, just ignore these three here. These are just like season rewards. These can't like they're not traded things. So I think we've got seventeen crates. Just in stroke crates and probably about maybe another fifteen, twenty in items like this. But I'll have to leave it as that for this episode but if you did enjoy don't forget to drop a like and subscribe way down below uh comment like what you liked about the video and just try and if you didn't like it just let me know like what i could do better but apart from that i'll see you next video peace